Hello everybody, how is it going? And welcome back to another episode of Goblin Stone. Guys, I have a plan today. We are going to switch up our little uh, little warband. I want to get an acolyte into the whole squad. And I think it is a good idea to actually drop one of the tanks. So let me go ahead and try to build an acolyte guild. Uh, never mind, we don't have we don't have the wood for it. But we have an acolyte, and I think we're gonna just bring him in and see how this is gonna go. What we need is wood, so we are going on a little gathering excursion today. Therefore, uh, first of all, we're gonna breed. A we always wanna breed. We always always wanna do that. Leaders. So Any let's go ahead and take. Honestly, fate shaper is pretty solid as a as an acolyte. I wanna bring him. But yeah, we're gonna get the best of the best here. You are like ferocious and fit. Ferocious is pretty cool for the um, for the extra power. But what I also want is maybe defensive or spirited. Flabby is not great. Ruthless is meh. But I want the blue one. Come on. Give me a blue goblin. And by the way. No, never mind. I was like, one yellow plus green equals blue? Life. Color theory, anybody? Not really. All right. Who do we have here? 677. Seven, not bad. You are... Yeah, you're pretty good. With the ferocious and spirited, I, I think I want you. I want you. Absolutely. 777. Seven, seven. Ruthless. Not bad. Spirited. I mean, I'm gonna get you, my friend. Uh, you are hard-headed. Stun resistance, gourmand, and beast avert. I don't care about you. May they prosper, the other two guys, wherever they welcome will. aboard. Please join my squad. Koif Toiler and Claw Slider. But the barracks are full now. All right, it's fine. It was just the thing I wanted to do before I embark on an adventure because um, it's always a good idea to do that. Now, who do we get rid of? We need to drop one of these two. You have a lot of resistances acquired over the course of your adventure time. You also got Dark Vitality, which is not bad. Hmm... Lead Reader. Oh, Lead Reader has the better stats overall. Which is probably really good for breeding when you think about it. Seven armor, man. You got six. Ah, Clam Timber. I know you got the better resistances, but I think you also give us four. Yeah, you give us four souls, so. Enjoy this your retirement. Days <laughs> I should not do that, I know. Uh, let's get the... Uh, wait, where's the Acolyte? Uh, huh? Where is my Acolyte? Was it Howledecker? No, it was Fade Shaper. That was the name. Let's go ahead and bring that guy in. You can run a bone for a 30% speed bonus. That's pretty good. Yeah, I like the speed on you. Also has a decent amount of power. Now, when we take a look at the skill set here real quick. Uh, yeah, we can't. <laughs> we just can't. Do we want to change any of your skills? Uh, I want to get rid of Flabby. I want to get Spirited. <laughs> Absolutely, my friend. Oh, you have Magic Armor. Huh. I don't like Magic Armor too much, though, I gotta say. Should we go Defensive? Also gets Magic Armor then, right? So, plus five power after killing a foe. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? Let's mix it up a little bit and see where this is going. It could be really bad because now we are missing defense. But hey, let's go. Into the hinterlands. I want to go for a Scourge. Scourge? Sure. Let's go to Brightwood. We can get wood here, which is... Oh, guaranteed wood. <laughs> yes, please. Don't mind if I do. Uh, the shields were kind of the same, so we don't really care about which you had. Oh, there was one thing. Um, hold up. The quarter stock with max life is good, but we got this thing now, which gives you five life per attack. That is a great way to get some sustain without the need of another tank. You can just chop away and just eat the enemy's life force. So that's good. Yeah, and the other guy had the bonus armor. The other hunter has an armor of five or so. So we should be somewhat sad where the forest is there. we don't necessarily need two tanks. To Just do it with DPS and the occasional heal. Each party member's attack has a 20% chance to inflict slow. All right. All right, we'll do it. Crazy map. They Give me something good. 
stone for its blessing. Add four power to two random equipped weapons or each party member's crit is increased by 20. Both are huge. I mean, they're pretty good. I think I'm gonna go with Finesse. Because we have the Raider, which is kind of relying on crit, and we have high damage output from the Hunters, which is also very good if they crit. There's a shop up here. I think we go low. We're gonna go tough battle, regular battle, tough battle. We wanna harvest, so let's harvest. Let's do that. Oh, come on. No surprise. We find stone. It's Lionel Messi again. <sighs> All right, then. Okay, I think we want to always intercept now, right? Because you're my only tank, you have to tank. So bludgeon is pretty good. Healing prayer gives... Healing to all allies equal to... 30% of our power, so a heal for 8 on everybody. I mean, we can initiate that, why not? The other option would have been uh, protection on somebody. Wakey wakey slicing dagger. I think we go with the slicing dagger on the halfling. That guy is really nasty. He can incite fury and... Oh, that's bad. Okay. And yeah, Fu fury is really, really bad. Also, Dung Trap. Spirit Rush could be good. Pestilence could also be pretty good. Got a pretty good crit chance. Let's go. Exceptional skill. And Trap. We did get the Trap. But I feel like we are... It's not kind of working as intended. Oh my god. As intended. Did they get hit by it? Yeah, they did. Okay, so this is working. Holy crap, what are we doing now? Beast Bane Arrow, Devious Shot. I'm gonna go for a shot. <clears throat> Just get the damage out there. And yes, you heal with every attack. That's perfect. <laughs> you need it, man. You totally need it. Um, Guard. Who shall we guard? You, my friend. No. Why not? Let's do it. It's fine, there's a big heal coming. The haste is a problem, though. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Sudden strike. 50-50 for a crit. No. Dude! Stop it! Think we need to start another healing prayer, right? Actually, no, I think the shield is better right now because you are always on the front line because of your stun currently. Yeah. Alrighty then. Alrighty. Go for another intercept on you. It really feels like my Acolyte is not really... I mean, he's, he's supporting. He's not really the damage dealer that I wanted. And yes, it's an Acolyte, but he also has the big swing with the hammer. Uh, let's go... Let's go sudden strike again. I want the haste. We didn't get the haste, but we get a slow. Yeah. Immune. All right. Devious shot is good. That kills the back line. Hell yeah. One of them out. Okie dokie. Are you still praying? 15% of your power plus your spirit. You are still praying. How did you get up to the front so fast again? I thought it was like a five time, like a like a, a five time slot thing that takes five time slots to activate. Weird. Um, sure. I think it's another trap. It's a trap. Thank you for the block. So, I think it is actually time to... It's actually time to try to get the halfling down. What I wonder is, why is this outlined red? Uh, I know an upgrade of Pestilence is, it deals double damage to people who are slow, but that's the upgrade, and this guy is currently slow, so it's kind of weird here. Huh, okay. Mm, I mean, my crit is pretty high, we could fish for an instant kill on anybody. 
Yeah, 17 damage is fine. Bonk. Ooh, that's the healing prayer. I think another shield is important. Just to keep my resources up. Alright. Intercepting is what the tanks are made for here. Okay, so Wakey Wakey has the ability to kill the halfling captain if we get lucky with the crits. Shattering blow. Good. Another one bites the dust. Bit of a smacking here. We have a healing chant coming up. I love it. Come on, get the trap. Crippling <laughs> strike. We crit. Gotta love it. Purify. New. No. Got a lot of shielding going on. Oh, we just kill. Yeah. It's a way. It's a way to get things done. So in this instance now, I want to deal slow damage because the healing chant is coming. Here we go. Uh, yes, I'll do it. He's tired, which means double heal, and that makes everybody full again. <laughs> nice. So yeah, it was a fight where we... We managed. And in the end, we're coming out on top. So we used our resources. Cool. Bold attack. Cool. The unseen worked out. Art will bother them no more. Not even close. Alright, so a bit of minerals Nature's here, but I don't really need clean. them. Was there something or was it just a Yeah. A bit of a dust. We want. We want. What do we want? We want to stay on the high ground, definitely. Get another regular and then another tough fight. And then we go for the Guru. Here we go! So the Acolyte has a healing shock or something, uh, which should deal damage to undead. Let's just armor up here. Let me see what we got. So Swift Mend will deal damage to undead. But six is not a lot, honestly. I think I'd rather Sacred Shield somebody. Yourself, maybe? We have the lowest HP, so we're gonna try to keep you alive. These guys are quite bleed resistant, so I'm gonna go with a... Uh, let's take the two-turn thing. Yeah. Precise assault. East Bain long shot. It's a kill. It's a kill for two time slots. That's good. Progression. And then we go for Rust. Yeah. Nice See, the thing is, we have two instances of damage and uh, we have a pretty high crit chance right now, so I want to fish for these crits. This is a guard situation. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's guard the Raider. He is our most vulnerable guy. He has no armor, just his health pool. Healing chant. We don't need it. Uh, let's go for a kill. A vital blow. Didn't quite get it. But I'd say it's good enough. Wait, Swift meant? Yeah. Ha! <laughs> Kaput. Down goes the zombie. Feel the power of the light. And it was a very quick attack, which is really, really good. Uh, that's a fish for a kill. Yeah, perfect. It was like a one in four or so where we didn't kill. And yeah, I would say wakey wakey is a kill because crit. There it is. Easy fight. Absolutely easy. There we go. Get some extras here. Well, 100 gold. If we find a shop here. There was a shop in the in the very beginning, yeah. I wanted to say if we find a shop, we might be able to buy some wood. Mm. So this is supposed to be a tough fight, huh? Okay. 
Where's the music? Music? Hello? Music? Music is tired. Music doesn't want to do anything right now. Purify doesn't help. Healing prayer. Yep, I'm gonna start a prayer right now because... Um, yeah, this fight is gonna go for a while, right? Get the haste. Thank you. Excellent strike. The game feels so weird without the music all of a sudden. There's a key element missing. It's crazy. We get the slow. Wait, you have that on your weapon, right? A chance for a slow? Or is the dunk trap also a slow? We have so many slows recently, which is fantastic, man. Uh, let me try to trigger it immediately. What? Exceptional skill. Nice. Oh my god. They don't stand a chance. That's a kill as well. Holy crap. I don't think we're gonna get the healing chant off. All the healing prayer is, is right? Um... Yeah, we keep blasting, right? Let's go. Let's just do it. Yeah, that hurts a little. I really hope that the music is coming back. As soon as we get out of here. That's the kill. Shattering blow. And all of a sudden, that's a 1v6 situation. Um, yeah, if we intercept you, you always will attack my tank. And that's exactly what we want. Let's keep up the haste. Eh, not this time. Ooh. Ooh. Real big attack. I mean, I could kill now. He would attack my tank. Yeah, let's give it a little bit of time, if we can. I want to get out of here ideally with maximum health. We can give the sacred shield to the tank. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. It's pestilence. Spirit rush on, I don't know. Guy in the back. Blocked. Cool. Uh, slicing dagger for slow damage. Come on, get get the healing prayer. Just an armor. There we go. That's what I wanted. Just try to be a, as optimal as possible. Okay. Music. Summoning their nice. fortitude, they move on. All right. Patience and again. Is bitter, but its fruit is sweet. Okay. It, it is the least, wasted. the least interesting thing here. Oh, we can go upstairs. Not what I want, honestly. I think we go Guru into Harvest, Tough Battle into Goblin. The Guru is also going to help us. Want to see what the Acolyte can do with upgrades? The old Guru has much to teach. Beastbane. Beastbane is not relevant here. Not really. Soul Gale. That is good. Intercept is also pretty good. You know, intercepting twice is fantastic that when only having one tank. Boy. It's good action economy. Here's Swift Mend. Uh, what is that? Undecked. If used on yourself, heal for twice the amount. Yeah, there's a point for it. Sacred Shield. Bestow protection and heal the target for 20% of your spirit. Sure, why not? Yeah, improve. A little bit of a heal. The Dunk Trap. More damage. You inflict poison as well. I like it. Long shot is just more damage, correct? Yeah. I like the poison addition here. That's good. Anything to find here? No? Okay. So we wanted tough battle into goblin. Another tough battle. Oh boy. Another Yumi. There we go. We got the ambush. We should probably rearrange a little bit. I think the um, the raider should be behind the hunters now, because I want to get these traps out first. 
Okay, let's armor up. Shield. Who do we shield? Yourself, I'd say. Crit or like super fine. squishy. Okay, wakey wakey pick wounds, a slash. I really want to go for the faster attack right now. <laughs> yeah, we get a crit a anyways. Blow. Nice. Beast Bane chop. Here's the thing. If we get the trap, I'm gonna drop it. If not, we're just gonna chop it. Good. Having this early is really good. Because of the poison. <laughs> yes. So he's gonna die thanks to the poison. And by the way, poison works in a way that is different from bleed. The first uh, time it, it gets poison damage, it'll take the damage of the amount of stacks, so five. Then it will reduce the stack. The next time it, it drops, it's then four, three, two, one. So we have a total of uh, 15 poison here, correct? 15 damage in terms of poison. And the first instance is really high in terms of five. So he's gonna go down already. Let's intercept the second guy then. <clears throat> First time this ticks, it's gonna die. We also got Pestilence. <laughs> sure. First foe is slain. Very nice. You know, sometimes it's best to just get him out of here. Crit. Excessive Not bad. Skill. Okay. Not good, but also not terrifying. This is all right. Keep in mind, we got two healers, technically. The healing chant and the healing prayer both are both are here. So we get the halfling out with a quick slash. And then what? Devious shot on the back line. <laughs> Would be horrible overkill. I'd rather take the front line out right now. All right, here we go question that I have is, do we try... Yes, we try to get the heal. Why not? Healing prayer. Purify. Sure. I want the healing chant of the shaman. God, rattle. What, what are you trying to attack? Backliner. That's fine. So, what you need is a bleed? Pick wounds. Ah! Does it trigger the trap? The trap failed. This is exactly what we wanted. So we're gonna get the healing chant out. So everybody's up to full again. Or almost. And then we're gonna go for the kill. Chop it, chop it. That's pretty good. An unpleasant encounter. Patience is bitter, but its fruit is sweet. So, getting all of this, a little fruit. bit of extras here. We have so much money in this run. And then I probably want to rearrange a little bit. I think that is a good idea. Okay. Let's see what goblin we can find. Still, oh, I'm still looking for... I don't know, is 7 our cap on the stats right Something now? Of worth in I don't know. Unlikely place. So, who are you? Crit from the shrine is, uh, yeah, for everybody. We have open mind, which gives us mind plus 2 and lucky. Uh, yeah, but you're kind of bad. <laughs> like, your stat line is really, really bad. And you have a mind of 2? You guys are not worth it. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. We're gonna leave you here. <laughs> My barracks are full. I'm gonna push it. Nice. Okay. Another hard fight, another harvest that we technically don't care about. I know. I know, I know, I know. Again, we're gonna initiate with armor up if we don't have any guard or intercept abilities. Sacred shield on the acolyte just so that he's safe. It's fine. Now we want to drop the traps. With the poison and everything, I think it's a very good early on initiation. Chop him. Excellent. Insane. <laughs> what? That's amazing. 
When does the poison trigger at the end of a character's turn? All right. Killing stroke. Why not? Why not? We'll take it. It's not gonna be the biggest of deals, and he's gonna fall to the ground. Okie dokie. Uh, eh, I don't know. We'll blast. A shattering has the bit of, oh, has the bigger impact, I wanted to say. Negated that attack thanks to the protection. You're missing five, you're missing two. Get healed. Whatever. Alright. I believe we are still in this fight for a little while, so... I'm gonna go for that. Healing prayer or tear bludgeon? Let's do it! <laughs> Schnonk! <laughs> the high crit chance really makes a difference here. We want to go for the kill, obviously. Thank you. Vital blow. It was a great, great shrine blessing that we got there. Or was it the Oriflame? Uh, one of the two. Yeah, we're fine here. So, at this point, just go for the highest damage possible. Just knock him out. Wakey, wakey for the kill. <laughs> If we get the crit. And yeah, our Raider has a 56% chance to crit right now. That's massive. I want a shop. Give me a shop game. Nothing. I want to go home with some more wood and fiber. The stuff that we always need. Hmm. I feel like I don't care about the shrine right now. It's a temporary effect that helps me in the, in the boss battle. Let's have another look at a goblin instead. Something that is permanent, something that might help us in the long run. It's a floating skull. Hmm, does it come with the zombies? It does. So yeah, it, our setup works. As proven. So, Life Hunter needs to be guarded. He's our kind of squishy right now. Sacred Shield, sure. Staggering hit. Honestly, I do like the Acolyte now. It's kind of a nice hybrid. It can tank a little bit, it can heal, it can deal damage. Uh, it's a nice, like, man in the middle. Uh, chop it up. And this slow. Wait. I guess you were guarded. Alright, something happened there that I didn't realize. A precise assault. Pew. The slow of it all. You cannot spirit rush yourself, can you? No. Cannot. There is a 50-50 chance we get a kill here. Actually, a 3 out of 4. Down with you. Yep. So we take it. Hmm. So we crit, we kill. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. Just decimate them. Thrust is fantastic because we can deal damage to the backline and also take away the shield of the if the hinky punk. I guess we basically won. Uh, whatever. Whatever. He's slowed. He's not gonna take another turn. I think we're fine here. There's that. Exceptional okay. skill. Conflict, though unpleasant, is entirely necessary. We're getting so much stuff. I think at, at some point we need to upgrade our larder so we can carry more. Okay, friends. Please be good. If you're worthy, I'll take you. <sighs> four, four, five. <laughs> Spirited lucky. Eight, zero, six. So you're like uh, five... Two, no, six, three, six. I'm gonna say no, as much as it hurts me, which doesn't. A respectable hole. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and take a look at what we can find here. We are about to fight a boss, so a cozy fire welcomes the wayward. With a bit of combat speed, that's necessary. They for a moment by the warm flame. And then we're gonna heal up with the foodstuffs that we have. 
Right? This is the last thing that we go, that we do before. Yeah. Okay. We got six. Eat up. Nice. Okay. And the door is shut. Who do we fight here? I think we have not seen... We have not seen this corpse bride. What? Oh no. What's going on here? A princess, long dead and decayed to bones, wanders the woods endlessly searching. Huh. Hello, Banshee. No. I mean, these guys have literally no health. We can probably blast them with some AoE, but still. I am... I'm not trusting this. Okay. Healing prayer, I think we need it. We're gonna initiate it right now, so in case we take damage, we're gonna be topped off again. Okay, 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 okay. Dunk trap. Oh, this is not worth it, honestly. It's not worth the dunk trap, not at all. Crap! All right. So we kill one of the skellos. Nice. Um. Ten damage. That's nasty. Let's try to get fast. Ooh, good. excellent strike. Uh, by the way, a princess has four magic armor. We're gonna start guarding now. And by the way, Princess has 280 health. Does zero damage. 100% bleed resist. Yeah, she's a skeleton. And the other resistances are also pretty good. Fair enough. Take that. We got the slow on her. That's massive. Oh, that means that Wakey Wakey is really good here. Nice. <laughs> nice. Was that 35? I think. I think it was. We could drop the trap on her now in case she summons again. Then we got the skellies right away. I think that's a good idea. Now we just don't want to spring it. Nah. This is an instance where I don't want it to. Yeah, succeed. But hey, the poison as well. No, actually, that's good. We are quite stun resistant, though. We could deal 10 damage here. I'll take it. 15 with crit. Attack. Hmm. Another trap. It's the best thing we can do. Poison stacks, correct? Hold up. Hold up. A crippling is, is, is that a boss killing mechanism? Ah, it just refreshes. Okay, fine. It doesn't stack on top of the five that we already have. Fair enough. Makes sense. Um... Aggression wins the game. Just go for it. With our massive crit, I feel like we should just go. Pestilence. No. It's a blast. It's totally a blast. So, Princess, what now? You lost half your health. You're poisoned. And we definitely have the upper hand right now. It's no difference. It makes no sense to drop a trap right now. Let's just go for it. The healing prayer is coming out in a second, so prepare for some life. Nice crit. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I think it's... Ooh, it's a devious shot. The skeletons are the only way of damage that I've seen so far from the princess, so I guess we'll just take him and be safe and just pommel. Intercept. She's about to attack Life Hunter, huh? I don't care. Staggering hit. Let's kill her. Let's kill her. Yeah. <laughs> the stun, the slow, the everything. Pick wounds. Why is it flashing up? She's not bleeding. Wait. <gasps> also works for poison. I see. I see. 
Okay. Um. It's fine. A precise assault. It is fine. Healing chant is not needed. I guess we rather blast her. And we get the freeze. We get so lucky with all of our status effects today. We just have that and constant stun lock. Is this the end? Do we just win now? Uh huh. What? Whatever. Royal summons, huh? <laughs> Uh, long shot kills the princess. Yeah, but I think we have to deal with her minions still, huh? Very much looks like it. Uh, so <laughs> let's just do it. crushed. Even got the slow out. What? What? Come on. Yeah. Vital like, what can I say? With a final wail. The what can I say? It is just silence. my my goblins are murder hobos today. Uh, so this is 150. I guess we drop the junk. Do we drop the junk? Can we unbundle anything? It's the biggest they value. No more. They can carry no more. Let's go. So we will get some guaranteed wood out of this, right? Twenty. Yeah. All right. And then we also found like gold and other garbage. They can ca Holy macaroni, that was a fight and a half. I mean, it wasn't. A new day. We were dominating. Okay. I do like the setup though. What we now need is um we need a guild for the for the acolytes so I can actually manipulate the skills and everything. All right, let me check this out real quick. Going to drop that. Trade it in. Fair trade. Imbued bone. An eight power speed up. Ah, we're currently using the twig with a plus five power. So we have a 12 power blast. This is an eight power with a 30% speed bonus. Might be better. I said earlier, I do like the speed of it all. Really do. I need to think about it. It's not relevant right now. Um. So, what do we do? I think we actually... We actually drop a little bit Just of this, like, rock need. situation because I don't want to deal with it right now. Uh, <laughs> this is why. Larder is full. Yeah. I know. It's like your mom. Um, why is it still full? Come on, don't be full. I have an idea. Oh, give me, give me a second. I can upgrade this for my... Yeah. Look at that. Stolen ore. It's exactly what we want. We get a bit of extra healing. Life recovered from the camps, which we are not using. But you know what? I'd rather have it upgraded than having my stuff lying around. Okay, that gives us a bit. Still so much. <laughs> okay. Um... I will take a look at the at the skills in a second. Maybe we can already build our acolyte, our me. acolyte guild. Okay, just to make sure that I'm not missing this. Ugh. Okay. So, huh? Come on. Guess that. There's that. Nah, we have so point. much money right now. Could we just build another larder? Yeah, for fiber, which we don't have. Which also means that we do not have enough for the Acolytes Guild. Oh, what a shame. I could build another armory, it seems. I have lots of ore and leather. And wait, you guys said that you could combine these? So what about this? And this? So yeah, just having more stacks. How do I combine this? I have two armories. Oh wait, this one is upgraded. The other one's not. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, we need ore. Can I have more ore, please? 
Uh, there's wood on sale. I like it. I'll take it. So that is a reason Just to actually keep the... things around. To build multiples so that you have like more storage room. That's okay. But yeah, guys, since we cannot upgrade our, our guild right now, we cannot build a guild. Uh, I would say that has been it for today. Hope you enjoyed the episode. And if you did, then don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.